Okay, this, uh, this is a video about uh, color tattoo, and this is my two uh, tattoos and have uh, different colors and different shading on the pictures with that color. With the color, it's on the right side. You see the wasp uh, with the green uh, legs and red and green horns and turquoise blue wings, and the other side you see the frog. So it's black and red, uh, green eyes, green leaves, have yellow, orange and red uh, leaves. The, things, the thing I want to show with that, this picture uh, from my two tattoos is the, the more darker the picture are, uh, the lesser you can see the uh, orange uh, and the yellow and the red, very smaller red, on this the uh, the red uh, on the picture and this kind of thing. So that the the point with this is to risk when you make a um, color tattoo uh, on your skin, it's important to uh, to know where how dark the skin gets. But this is the picture on the, with the wasp, it's much more how my skin looks in the winter. And this the other side of the picture with the frog is much more how my skin looks in the summer. So you can really see some colors uh, on the skin um, It's less visible when, uh, when the, the skin gets more browner if they are smaller. So that is the interesting thing here is if you can look the, um, the the yeah the picture on the frog have the big red leaf are much more much more visible on the dark and the uh, smaller red leaf on the upper side of the, on the tattoo so that is what I mean with that is if it is very important to make a more bigger line uh, more bigger line uh, of that color than smaller. For the smaller the tattoo are, that's less visible the, the, the tattoo get when the skin get more darker. So if you have similar color red and red, and one red is really small and the other red is very big, the big one is much more visible to the uh, smaller one. And, and the same you can see with the green leaf uh, under, uh, from the pipe is that you can see the green, uh, dark green leaf, but, and the, on the pipe is purple, but you cannot see that purple. For that purple is disappearing, for it's dark, you cannot see through the dark uh, if you have that brown skin. So, yeah, so it's important to to really, if you make a color tattoo, it's important to see how your skin tone is getting in the summertime. So that you have, your line needs to be bolder and more uh, stronger colors on that skin for the skin to be showing much more better. Showing better on your skin in the summertime. So always when you uh, do the tattoo, and uh, this, sorry. You forget to plot your YouTube video here, kissing me. So, okay. Sorry, I, I really need to go back to start. It's like this. When you start to make, uh, if you have darker skin, everybody can have color tattoos. You, you, you just need to find a good way to put that skin, uh, that color on the skin to make it bright and looks good in the long term on your skin. So, the one thing is the always is a good thing to do is um, when your tattoo artist is writing up your tattoo, is to ask that tattoo artist to take uh, to put that uh, that color tattoo 
on the computer and make this background on the on the uh, uh, tattoo on the uh, on the screen more darker or browner, the similar brown as your skin get in the summer if you're a long time outside in the summer the skin get darker to see how well that color will work uh, and work so the, so yeah so, it's, so this is not a perfect this is not a, any kind of perfect showcase of that picture this is very it's much better if you have a computer to make that so it's one thing you can see on this picture is the yellow is almost invisible when the skin gets that, uh, that uh, dark. Comparable if the skin w was in the lighter tone in the skin. Um, that, that, that don't mean you cannot have yellow, that just, just means you need to make the yellow bigger or have some green behind the yellow to put the yellow forward from forward in the skin when you yeah when you do the tattoo so the thing i uh, know that you know that as green is very good and big red is very very good red like red is perfect on brown skin like red is very very good and green too but every color works you just need to find a good way to have some color around that color to make it more fluid around that color in the tattoo. So the other thing I want to talk about is this one. Is the, my the, the turquoise wings uh, on my wasp is is too light. That that color will will almost get almost disappearing or be get very muddy. For more darker the, the skin gets with the lighter color is not a good mix. You can have that color, but you really really need um, to make sure that that color is good balance with your skin from the winter to the summer and so on. So that's why the picture is different. Sh shading on the picture is more darker on this side than more lighter on the other side on the picture. It's because of the showing some part of showing what I mean with uh, how the summer looks comparable to how I, my skin looks in the winter. So yeah, so that is uh, one thing I really recommend, really recommend against is don't use any light. Uh, like water, like light, like sea water color, or sea, uh, like a sea blue, or like light sea blue, and like sea, like light sea blue, like when the sunlight on the sea, on the sea, uh, on the upper sea, you can see the, through the light, uh, water. For that, we get gonna be very unvisible in the summer term when you get skin get darker. So always try to have. Um, uh, the uh, same color but much more darker than your skin similar like um, darker than the skin are in the summer when you are on the uh, on outside the whole days in the strong sunlight it's a very good to have stronger line bold line so it's really showcasing the form of the tattoo and have a strong color in that tattoo to make the, the color um, be more powerful than your skin tone are to, to let the color almost like uh, put uh, we, the color get much more heavier on your skin than a lighter color on your skin if like this yeah I maybe yeah so the things is also about the big how big the tattoo are is also one factor in the how your tattoo will look with the color and the placement of that tattoo on the body is also a very important thing on that tattoo. So you can see here the on my wasp uh, with says red and green and the uh, and the turquoise blue wings. The wings are gonna looks got I really need to do um, a big touch up on the wings because in the summer this that color will get very very 
unseeable almost because of how dark the skin gets in the summer if you have brown skin the, yeah so this the, the problem with this color is this too much blue and too much white in that that uh, blue the turquoise blue comparable to the green so you have you always have to find a balance with the color I think green you have need much more green in the turquoise blue than you need blue in the turquoise blue if you know what I mean if you maybe need 10% uh, blue or maybe f f uh, 13% uh, green to make them more visible and absolutely if you can really really try really really try against uh, to uh, the less white you should have in that uh, tattoo in two in the same way because if you the more lighter this that tattoo are with the white coloring in the uh, in the color the lesser visible that tattoo will get when your skin get darker so the more more powerful color you have the more darker and your skin get in the summer and more stronger line like black line around that tattoo for show take form like um okay if like example like if you have a skull a skull tattoo it's very important that skull tattoo a very important line around the skull that you can see the shape of the skull on your skin and then it's important after that it's important to have a, a strong color that will always be very visible when your skin get darker so it's not about the color it's about how strong power in that color that you have the lighter you have and you have darker skin the lighter will you have always have to com compromise with the colors to make that color more visible because if you don't the, the color will be very invisible if you have very very like a baby blue light like baby blue and you have dark dark skin that baby blue will almost surely be disappearing uh, be very 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 invisible if you don't have anything under that tattoo like uh, something to have it up from the skin and this kind of thing so this uh, is uh, I think um, so that is one thing so it's important and I think the color I can recommend in some cases I can recommend is uh, the one thing I can really recommend is red like d dark red and green green I'm really sure about I have two now with green and they work very well green and red red is 100% I can recommend and but don't use if you have similar color as me like brown uh, and you're Latin American brown like a like a, like a brown like a dark middle dark like a dark brown like a one five maybe six ten percent brown I really recommend against using purple like normal purple because you really you can use purple but to have if you have no at red work use some red in the purple to have it up from in the skin from so this is very important and other thing is very very important if you have color tattoos is try as much as possible with that color tattoo do not have lots of white in that color tattoo because the, you can, of course you can have white but the more white you have in that color tattoo the whiter will be more dominant in the color uh, sectum in the ink comparable if you have lesser uh, color and then if you have really really dark skin and you have a very 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 like, uh, like a sunlight uh, yellow uh, flower like a really, really yellow, light yellow flower and you have dark dark skin that and and you're in the summer get any more darker the skin get more darker that yellow will look very very bad if you don't have anything around that yellow so to put it forward you know some strong dark strong strong green around it yellow to really have it up in the skin so yeah this is my uh, there was a, my recommendation is try always try to have a color so more brighter and stronger than 
your skin get in the summer to make always showing that your the color always the ink always win over your color uh, in the term in the long term because of the lighter they are if your skin get if your skin is darker and your light ink the skin the skin tone will be overpower overpower that ink and make that ink lesser visible in the future in 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 the aging period and so on so this is something to think about and try to try it as much as possible if you have brown similar to my skin brown skin and darker skin to avoid to avoid white white ink as much as possible you can have white ink but don't make the white ink a dominant factor in the coloring of the tattoo for that will make the tattoo much faster uh, disappearing and I one thing I can really say right away is purple for me was quickly disappearing like it only maybe take two days and the purple was disappearing so that is also an important thing to know that some colors will will not work if you not have a very 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 experienced tattoo uh, very experienced coloring with the, that purple to make that purple always stand strong you maybe need something like a, something in the background like maybe a green or red to make that purple stand over the green to make sure like the almost like a like a, a mirror mirror ink wave like a, a mirror to almost really really power it up if you just have purple and no line just normal purple that if you have dark skin the purple will it is very quick and so there's there's a reason why some people say to use the red purple for red is very good on dark skin and to put red in the purple like to, to really have it up is a very good thing to do and always always ask your tattoo artist of course tattoo artists are the expert and and try to tell them ask them if they can show the same picture on the the line work they have done for your tattoo but on the more darker background on the computer to really show casing how that tattoo will look on you when your skin get darker and so you can really see how much that you need to so know the tattoo artist know how much more he need to improve that coloring on that tattoo to make it more visible and so on yeah I really hope this video was uh, helpful in any way and there's many good I think there's one good site if you look on, the com on Google you can just read coloring on uh, black skin col col color tattoo on black skin and there's some tips there on the internet and showing different way and recommendation and so on and so on uh, yeah and ask around yeah